Kumasi Jamalan on our way to the culture center. All that he said is true. And it's, it's, it's really enlightening. Um, my higher self is guiding me into everything that I do. Yes. When you select who you are, when you went to bed, time that you select, you know the morning traffic, your body traveling to bed. Now, what? By the time that you are going to off that time, the garden city. And when you sleep, sometimes you have a dream that there are some people who interpret dreams and orders. Uh, some are true, some are not true. Some of them, uh, 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 they just want you to feel comfortable. <laughs> so they will interpret it to your, the, the, the best of their knowledge that will suit you. But it is God, He said, you will dream dreams. The young who dream dreams, uh, uh, the young who have vision, the old who dream dreams. That is true. The young guys have so much vision. Now, who gives you that vision? Your higher self gives you that vision. Straight up traffic. From People have different type of names. What I love about it. That Ghana, you call God. Even in Ghana here. Countries. And all that has meaning. So, what happened? God is the one, he's the creator of the universe. He created you, he breathed in you, his breath is in you, his strength is in you, his strength is in you. You may decide to go this way. When you hear the voice of the Lord, it will tell you go this way. When you go this way, it will be good for you. When you take your own world and you go this way, something might happen to you. Thank you. It happened to all of us, every day. I was driving, and then all of a sudden, someone crossed me. I got angry. I wanted to cross him and push him into the bush to go away. You know what? It was so dangerous. And I, I was driving 160 kilometers per hour. So you can imagine. I got so angry. And then, God just delivered me. I didn't understand. I got angry with this guy. All of a sudden, there was a, uh, a, a vehicle that had two tires at the back. Uh, oh, one, uh, it, it, uh, we call it a pickup. Kia pickup. All of a sudden, he also came from the bush. A certain, not far from where my, the incident happened. This guy also came from the bush and the guy fell off. Crossed this guy who crossed me terribly. Mine was even nowhere to compare with that one. And as the guy was going, the uh, 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 pickup speed up, as he speed up to go, not knowing there was, a, because it's a, a double tire, there was a stone in the tire. And the, the stone came out and hit the guy's windscreen. Boom. He said, as a human being, I should have said, oh, sorry, then go away. I go there and he sorted him in addition. <laughs> he sorted the guy who crossed me. I said, God punish you for crossing me. God punish you what God has done. Later on, when I went, then the, 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 the Lord was asking, I delivered you from this. Why do you insult this guy? Yeah. I delivered you. I know you have to go home see. I know you have to do this. I put you off from this trap. I just shield you. I protected you. Why do you insult him? And I, in my car, I started asking for forgiveness. <laughs> Between myself and God. <laughs> You see, so God delivers us from evil almost every now and then. There was another taxi driver who also did the same crossing. I got angry, heard him from the steer, bring him, I wanted to, here we don't use gun, we use our hands. The worst is to fight. And I know he can fight. I picked, I wanted to give him a blow. All of a sudden, <coughs> I saw something hitting my elbow. Like, like your walking stick. I turned, there was this old man, at the age of about, between 80 and 90 years, he's an old person, walking with a stick. I turned and then he used a gun dialect that, why do you want to fight this guy? 
this guy is dead already. This guy wants you to go to prison. When you blow him, he will die. He wants someone to push him into his grave. Don't push this guy into his grave. Wow. Leave him alone to you. As I, my hand was like this, now I felt the guy like this. I released the guy. The man took off his uh, uh, walking stick. As I turned like this, looking for to say thank you, sir, the man is gone. I couldn't find the man. They, they were going on, beep, beep, give us time. I blocked traffic, I have to go. I care less. I was looking for the man to say thank you. Within a split of second, the man is gone. I couldn't find that man in a accident. Or just so if you are always connected to your higher self, if you are always in, in tune with your creator, he delivers you. He will guide you wherever you go. He said, my higher self is in me. And that is positive. Every day, everywhere. Whatever you find yourself, you can. Just need the praise now. Amen. Some serious traffic coming. Ashay is the same as Amen. Yeah. In Islamic, you say Amen. Uh -huh. So what is the difference between Amen and Amen? It's the same spell. It's the same. <laughs> okay. This morning, today, in passing, there is some amount of traffic along this area. Um, we are driving to. A place that is so important to all of us and I will tell you why we are going to a place where the founder of the Ashanti kingdom uh, promulgated the good history from the skies and he placed a sword on that he did a whole lot of things and that sword is still there that we will go and see the sword from today a lot of people have tried to exhume the sword, but they were not able to progress. From there, we will go to uh, a cultural center. Yes, ma'am. Is that the sword was placed where? Come again. The sword was placed where? It was placed where? Yeah, yeah explain the story a little bit. Okay, clearer. I will talk about that. I'm just giving the itinerary for today. The reason today. why I asked this European story based on that same concept. Thank you. Okay, thanks so much. Uh, I'll talk about it. And you will see it with your eyes today. <clears throat> From there, we'll go to the cultural center. When you go to the cultural center, it has uh, so many shops that they sell so many souvenirs. We'll go around all that place. And then there is also a museum. Uh, the founder of Ashanti Kingdom Museum. Uh, we will also go to the museum, Prempe, the second museum. We we'll go there. Everything that is in that shop is to sell, 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 sell. Or shop, 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 shop. As I have promised, you are doing well. You are doing well in terms of buying and everything. You are really helping the economy to grow. And we love that. As a result of that, if you want to go to the ATM, I will help you to do that. Yeah, I can, you can empty your account here in Ghana. Buy everything you do. <laughs> yeah. Debbie and I, we got the hang of it. Oh, don't worry. When you get to the airport, I'll tell them that you have helped the economy so much, so they should allow you to go. Don't charge the weight. Allow them to go. Thank you. Okay, please. <laughs> Now, no, 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 it is a teaching hospital. Oh. It's a center of excellence. It happened that a woman gave birth to a baby. And when he gave birth, the baby's hands were closed like this. 
in the olden days when he didn't give birth to a child, they take him to a soothsayer or uh, a, a, a priest, a traditional priest, to interpret and to see the uh, profession of the child, what is the child is coming to do, this and that. Sometimes the child is a visitor. And if the child is a visitor, the child, every visitor, what happens? It goes away. Um, if the child comes in to stay or is a visitor, wow. so they need to check orders. Yeah. If you give birth to a child and the child died uh, or passed on before the eighth day, the child is known as a visitor. Oh. The kids came and visited the, uh, the, the distant relatives and go. It wow. can be some, some people believe that it's some old, old man. Uh, Asian people who just wish to say hello and go away and all this. Thing. When it happens like that, no funeral is at all. There is no funeral. We just go and bury the child and that's all. Yeah. yeah. And then um, they found out that they took him to a place and it was interpreted that this child is a deliverer. He's come to deliver a certain group of people, a certain type of people. And that, <clears throat> so uh, they taught him. Uh, uh, this is one of the things you always see around this area. If you're around the hospital, always wow, wow, wow. Make it so, um, he, he, he taught him, and when he came uh, up, he did a lot of wonders, a lot and a lot of wonders. Um, we don't use our bare hands in climbing palm tree, get it? He's the only person that I've heard that. You cannot. Uh, it's full of thorns, but he did it. And then he got to a place that he said he had to go to his people. So he left where he is. Uh, nobody knew how he came to Kumasi. At that time, it was not known as Kumasi. <clears throat> the name Kumasi came as a result of a certain thing that he did. And I'll tell you all this. So when he came to Kumasi, uh, he came to this area. He befriended the chief, he became a friend to the chief. And he told the chief, at that time, uh, the people in this area um, were being ruled by another kingdom. Remember that I said, um, in the olden days, uh, 400, 500, 300, 200 years ago, even 90 years ago, uh, we don't have, uh, uh, what do you call, something like a country. No, in those days, it was a kingdom, kingdom. Uh, you remember the Songhai Empire, Mali Empire, yeah. Ghana Empire, all those things were kingdoms. Mm -hmm. So they were living in kingdoms. And in this kingdom, one of them is the Ashanti Kingdom. Okay. So he came here, and then uh, there's another kingdom uh, closer to Cape Coast area uh, called Dentia. The Dentia people were ruling them. There are some things that they're supposed to bring. They were just subjecting them, giving them a whole lot of things. So when this uh, young man came to this area, then told them he want them to do a certain things, then they will be able to overcome their masters so that nobody will do them again. Every year there is a certain a great gold, this, that, they have to send to the dentures people. The dentures have every right to come and choose a wife, a woman from a woman. Uh, okay. We're going to military base, right? Uh, yeah, this is. Oh, hold on, please. Put off your camera. Right, hold, you the camera off. Oh, hold on, there's a stand and stop right there. No, no, it's a military. They will not. They will not. Just 